Hi, I'm Debbie and welcome to my channel Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for July 22nd and 23rd, Monday and Tuesday for my Tauruses. Hello my Tauruses, how are you? I hope doing really good. Okay, so short reading. I'm using my Radley Valentine Angel Tarot cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused the deck with Reiki energy. But remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Take what you like, leave the rest. That's okay. The 23rd, we are going into um, Leo season, passionate burning um, season. It's very, But I think it's going to be a good season for you too. And also, sometime this week, I will be posting my August videos. Okay, let's see what we have for... Oh, okay, you definitely want it to be seen. Let's see what we have for Tauruses. I will cut the cards. Pull out two. Okay. One and two. And this bottom card. Okay. Bottom card wanted to be pulled out. So this one, we're just going to look at this one fast. This one is air, nine of air. And as we go into, you know, it, this is Gemini. This is Libra. This is Aquarius energy. This is, you know, whew. The winds blow in, the winds blow out. Um, okay, you might be having something that, um, I don't know, maybe something's ending for you. Maybe th something's coming to an end, like a project of some sort, and you're like, well, what am I going to do next? And I'm going to tell you not to worry about that. This is more long term. It could be just Monday and Tuesday too, but this is more like, you know, what am I going to do next? I, I need to, I'm starting to worry about my future. And this is, you know, basically don't. You're, you're putting out that negative energy. It's still part of that July messing with you type of energy. And this is expecting the worst, self-fulfilling prophecy, sleepless nights. So just be aware that that type of energy keeps wanting to creep into your thoughts. Push it out. Push it out. Make that connection. Higher power, guardian angel, spirit guides. Voice of the Universe Divine, make that connection and push it out. I'm going to put that card back over here now because, yeah, because we don't need that energy in here. Now, three cards are face down. This middle card is reversed, says pay attention. Let's see the first card. Eight of Fire. So fire energy, again, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. We're going into Leo season, very passionate. It's going to burn. I feel like, you know, um, it's it, it's burning a lot of your negative energy out. Um, so, you know, that card, we don't want to even think about that card. And it's very passionate. So this is events moving at a fast pace. Delays are over. Many things happening at once. So while your mind might be, again, with that saying, oh, what am I going to do? Kind of that wringing of the hands, worrying. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's going to move past you. If you are, if you're worried about your, you know, relationship and that, again, job, personal, family, and that things are kind of rocky, don't, I mean, can I tell you that something's not going to, you know, is something not going to come to an end? I don't know that. that it could come to an end. But, um, and then, but if it does come to an end, it's because that new something is starting, is going to be happening. And there might be some healing. I don't know who that, who's that for, but you might need to do some healing so that new stuff can happen. But this is about, you know, again, events moving at a fast pace, delays are over, many things happening at once, to the point that you may feel a little overwhelmed or a lot overwhelmed, and, and you're kind of like, you know, like, oh my gosh. And so, and that could be where your worry is. Maybe there's so much coming into, into you. Maybe you're being, and I feel that, you know, you, you could be getting some really good blessings but it's like, when's the other shoe going to drop? So live in the moment. Live in the moment. Try not to think so much into that future. Enjoy what you're being given. Think of that as a present. Okay? I like that when it's, you know, what was it? Um, okay. Um, yesterday's history. Tomorrow is a mystery. Today is a gift. That's why we call it the present. So enjoy the moment. Now, Next card is reversed, the Ten of Earth. Again, this is what we were just talking about. Earth energy, your energy, Virgo, Capricorn, and then something has to end in order for your blessings to come, okay? And this is a very fa happy family life. Remember, family is a relationship. Financial security, finding magic in the little things in life. And again, that's keeping that connection, keeping that connection 
with that higher power so that you know things can move forward because things are starting to move forward for you no matter what your mind is saying there is something outside of you that it has to just keep you moving forward now next card the ace of earth and here is your new beginning this is so here is something ending in order for it to begin and here is your new beginning so yes um, probably more so with Leo season that doors I feel doors opening like you know how it's like you know like like the double doors by the, the French doors and then they open and then you walk through them and you know it's like applause okay so this is it's like you're going into that next step and now is it going to be as grand as that maybe yeah probably not we're realistic this is life but it's gonna feel good it's gonna feel good I don't feel like you're feel, I don't feel like you're having a real high with it it's not like you're in a um, you know excuse me but a manic type of stage I, it's just like okay I'm going I'm going forward into my future so this one is the inflow of abundance a promising business venture important documents or contracts so you might have some contracts to sign there might be a loan you might be getting a loan um, not necessarily a loan but money up front okay so it might be if you're and I, I'm going to just use these as examples if you're self-employed it might be okay here's a down payment and you know the rest will be upon delivery or you know every couple of weeks I give you a payment it's something like that too so watch I will always tell you this look at the fine print but I really don't feel that that I don't think that the this is an energy that's trying to um, scam you okay or con you I really feel that you know you just keep moving forward I love that I love that for you my Tauruses and I think that Leo season is going to be a good season for you and especially when all of these planets start going direct again okay I will have I don't know if I mentioned this but I will have my August videos out sometime this week so please watch for them and my Tauruses as always know that you are loved and be blessed Bye-bye.